There's a report that uh, the Niners have received a trade offer for Jimmy G for just two second round picks. Is that real, or is that John Lynch just trying to drive it up to get a first rounder? I I have not heard that. Um, I mean, I think that's the price they would do it at. I haven't heard that, and I'm looking around like, who could that be, right? I mean, they're not going to trade him to Seattle, I don't think. I don't believe the Panthers have made that offer, nor, you know, is anyone trading for Jimmy G right now just off surgery? Like, I'm still not so sure about that. So I imagine if they had that offer, they would take it. Lynch isn't a big bluster guy. Like, he's not – he doesn't lie. Like, he's just a pretty regular dude. Um, I have a hard time imagining he would say that unless he really had it. Um, but I don't know. I have I have not heard that. And I'll tell you this. The longer we go in this thing and Jimmy G is still on the Niners makes me think that, like, they could keep him. I mean – let him into the playoffs last year. Well, I know it wasn't perfect, but like, would it be the craziest thing in the world to keep him and let Trey Lance learn for another year? Like, I could think of worse outcomes for the 49ers. I just don't see a spot for him. Wouldn't that be like exactly what every other team exec would say whenever they're thinking about getting Baker Mayfield or not? Like, like which, now Jimmy G's already been paid though. So that's yeah, the yeah. difference here. Mm-hmm. Baker has not been paid yet. So that needs to, I think that should be addressed. Just like Jameis. Didn't get paid. Jameis, I mean, he made money. He was an NFL Con- quarterback, yeah. obviously, but he didn't make that second contract. And he he has another 60 years of life to live, too. So whenever you think about money and everything like that. So I think that is the differing between 